You can never prepare for what is to come. Wait till you see what happens. What a day. Home and your chicks are where they're not supposed to be. All right, so the chickens got out. This is not good. I don't know if you can see. So yeah, they're, they're out and about. Yep, it's happening. Oh, well, they're not supposed to be. You really want to be a homesteader? It's not easy. It's a lot of work. It's a lot of work. But it's a beautiful thing. I love the world that God gave us. If you look around at the beauty, and how gorgeous it is. The beautiful open field. You can never go back. What I mean by never go back, I mean never go back to living in cities and things. Yeah. All this to split. My husband's always gathering all kinds of wood. This was from a tree he had taken down somewhere. I don't know if you can see all the... That's definitely, uh, that definitely has not <laughs> winterized yet. But uh, boy, what a day. And let me tell you, I was so sick yesterday and I have not been feeling good today. That's why my hair is a mess and it's so darn long that it makes it very difficult. I got it tucked in my hat and oh my goodness. Um, so I was really sick. I drank bad water. Um, there was a, a break in one of the pipes we lost some pressure at the well and uh just a nightmare and i got sick i really did and i never drink my my tap water i always boil it i always filter it and i have tons of bottles and um just the regular organisms the, the regular bacteria that got in it from that loss of pressure i had three cups of tea i had one cup and then i wasn't feeling great so i had another cup and i nuked them in the, in the microwave i nuked them um one of them I, I did in the Keurig and so it wasn't a rapid boil and I found I didn't realize this until late last night and uh, so I was sick as a dog and then um, doesn't matter today you still have to put your big girl pants on I went to the pharmacy got some medicine the doctor called excuse me I have the hiccups got some medicine the doctor called in um, came home drove in front of the property found the chicks all in the front of the property it's like oh my god <laughs> but you know what i wouldn't have it any other way i'm so grateful to god um that he put us in this in this beautiful in our beautiful home and that we're blessed the way we are and if it is god's will that we leave and we end up moving elsewhere i know that we will know that and he'll provide but I'm sorry guys, I, I just love upstate New York. I don't know why people are so negative about it. We are not the city, we are upstate New York. Crazy winds came out of nowhere, uh, as you can see. And I'm inside now, I'm gonna have another cup of tea. This time it will make, it will definitely reach rapid boil and I will use my purified water. And I will be on later to talk to y'all. I wanna to talk to you guys. Please keep your head on a swivel. There's a lot of unsettling things going on um, with this uh, case that with that Kyle Rittenhouse. So please be alert, be aware, be prepared, pray and prep. I'll be on later. I have a lot to talk to you about. I hope you're all doing well. And definitely do the Ibotta if you can and give it to somebody in need or put it up. It's extra for you. Much love.